WKU Habitat for Humanity members help build houses for underprivileged communities. Hannah King has been chapter president for over a year. Her involvement in the group is breaking barriers. A lot of women are beginners with power tools and stuff. So just like having that organization that would support you, even though you're a female, is like huge, especially in like today's age because it's very intimidating. Um, but I'd have to say that being the president has been very like eye-opening. Like, yes, you can do it, you know? <laughs> Hannah says being able to give back time to the community is special to her. It was bittersweet, you know, because it was like, wow, this is really touching. Um, and just something as simple as like giving our time can help this, her situation. The bittersweet memory that Hannah is talking about was a build that they went to last fall. They were able to help build Sydney Ashby a house. Sydney Ashby recently had four brain surgeries after having a stroke. She shared some good news with her family over Thanksgiving dinner. Love us. Thankful for the family to be together and stuff. And I looked at my sister Dawn and I said, Dawn, I'm so sorry I lied to you. I said, but I got the house. Sydney's new house turned from this to this. After being able to meet the WKU team and walk in their new house, Sydney is very grateful. I just, I can't thank him enough. I don't know how to. For News Channel 12, I'm Brendan Ward.